Peace, love, and light, Pisces. I hope the sun is shining wherever you are and you're living in your greatest purpose, Pisces. Thank you for all your likes, comments, shares, and subscribes. We are on the road to 10K. Thank you for your support in getting there. Personal readings are being offered at this time. All information can be found in the description box as well as the community tab. Let's get into your messages. Hmm. Okay, let's check to see what is showing up for you, Pisces. Messages for Pisces spirit. Show Pisces energy. Six of Pentacles. Someone may be stingy at this time. Someone may not be willing to. It's like uh, some someone's withholding something perhaps that you gave. Someone is not doing something that you're doing. Someone's unwilling to reciprocate something. Mm-hmm. Someone's unwilling to reciprocate some someone, something, perhaps. Hmm. There may be a nine of cups situation with an emperor and empress, a nine to the ten. Hmm. Someone may be withholding something, withholding information. Withholding their feelings. <laughs> okay, let's see the situation with this uh, six of pentacles. Okay, King of Wands. So King of Wands showing up and a Ten of Cups, which showed up before. So I'm trying to see if, so this six of pentacles may be that someone's looking to get something reciprocated. Someone may be showing, like someone may be giving energy to something that they're not getting the energy back. King of wands, energy, and this energy may be going towards like a, a connection. This may be a family member. This may be someone that you consider close to you that you've, or someone that you've known for quite some time. Mm. Someone that you possibly considered having a 10 of cups with or you you could still be thinking about having this Ten of Cups with this person. Like, uh, there actually may be hope. This King of Wands is an energy of hope. There still may be hope that you would have this. Uh, and perhaps someone is not reciprocating something towards you. Or this person may be feeling like something is not being reciprocated towards them. And they're still optimistic. So, 
Mm. Someone's withholding something or someone is giving. Okay, this may be another water sign. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. That may feel optimistic about a situation with you, about a possible Ten of Cups with you. Hmm. This person still feels optimistic or they still have hope. And because this person has hope, it, it seems like they want to take action towards you. This could be a fire sign. It could be an earth sign. Could also be a water sign. Fire sign, the Sag, Aries, earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um, or a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I'm seeing that it could be either one of those um that may be optimistic about um a possible ten of cups with you it's like they're not get, they may not be getting it now or someone's not getting something now someone's optimistic about this ten of cups And or this could mean that someone has not decided to give back or reciprocate something in the past or they may not have and they're wanting and they're wanting to now and they're optimistic about it. Uh, let's see here. Tell me about this King of Wands. So this King of Wands is deciding to it's possible that this it, this is really a water sign. It could be a water sign that's uh, that's becoming more optimistic about this about something being reciprocated to them. This person may have felt a sense of loss, guilt. Someone's becoming optimistic with a situation having to do with you. This person may may actually feel like, you know, it's it's divine intervention for them to kind of like, you know, reconnect with you um, to keep moving, to keep having hope, um, possibly to heal a situation with you. Or this could be you feeling like this. It's like this person has or is having a renewed sense of energy. I'm seeing this may have to do with like a like this person perhaps like in a not too distant past may have felt loss or uh, hopeless didn't want to move forward kind of felt like they were staying in one place perhaps having to do with you uh, tell me more about this king of wands so i'm seeing whatever they felt in the past is not what they feel now yeah, absolutely. It's like this energy that's that wasn't reciprocated. You see how it came in reverse at first and now it's coming in the upright and it's accompanied by um it's also accompanied. Let me fix this. Okay. It's also accompanied by Someone being determined, having the willpower. It's like someone kept going. Someone kept an energy of optimism about something that... Um, it's almost as if like... Uh, let's fix this. 
it's mm. okay so i received a message just now it someone may feel like the veil is being removed from something that's that's giving them the willpower and motivation to move forward like there's something that's being revealed like something that was hidden that's being revealed um that's giving someone the motivation to move forward it, it's almost like someone's getting the information that they needed to move forward um someone could have been given something that they're waiting to receive this could be information um So in either case, however this person started, okay, however someone started previously, um, is not the same, they're not in the same position. It's like someone has kind of like, they're getting their bounce back kind of thing. King of Wands, like an energy of optimism, someone wants to, you know, almost like someone wants to, re like keep their loyalty or their word to do something this person wants to keep their word someone that's possibly wondered about you know the grass being greener on the other side or leaving a situation deciding whether you know they should continue to pursue it or not someone's deciding to continue to pursue something they've become optimistic like the way that they felt or probably the way that like some energy that they had uh it may have been a moment of doubt perhaps a moment you know of doubt represented by the five of cups this person may have had a moment of doubt and they're anticipating moving forward it's like the path is clear this person may actually want to come in towards you it could be this king of wands too this this fire sign um showing up here it's like a path has cleared they're manifesting something. Hmm. Okay, let's see about this Ten of Cups. Okay, so oh, someone sees a Ten of Cups with you you're appearing as the queen of wands this person's a king of wands or vice versa you're the queen you're the king and they're the queen um this person may feel like you're a good pair you're a good match there's something about you that keeps pulling someone back even if they may have doubted This person may feel like, you know, you have the same sense of loyalty as they do. They see a lot of like likeness in you. They see a lot of things that are, that's a likeness of them. This is why it's, it, this person is willing to like fight for this. Someone's willing to fight for something. Someone's willing or wanting, um, like a willpower definite willpower it's like someone feels like someone else is a good match and not only a good match they see that same energy that this person sees 
you having that energy that's similar to theirs um they feel like it can really like help them to progress or the, it can help the relationship to progress This person may actually want the happily ever after with you. This person's like adamant on having this happily ever ha after. Someone may have felt betrayed perhaps. This was, this may have had something to do with the lack of movement, the lack of giving. And now things are different. Okay, Ace of Cups and Knight of Cups, Nine of Cups. It's a, it's a, it's wanting to start over. Some, it's like someone wants to start over. Like even though you've known this person for quite some time, this it's like this person, you know, coming in and say, "Hey, I'm so and so. My name is so and so. Like, let's start over." Anything else about this Ten of Cups? It's like it's like wherever they want to be, you're there and you're the light at the end of the tunnel for them. It's like you're the you're the thing that helps them to overcome. Perhaps there's something about your energy that helps this person overcome. Okay, Nine of Swords. An energy of like possibly thinking, getting over stress, getting over a lot of things, getting over worry. Hmm. Possibly giving up old ways of thinking. Let's see what else is showing up here. There's that chariot card showing up again. Victory. Okay, what do you want us to know about this reading? That's interesting the cards just kind of did their own thing <laughs> they they turned around reversed themselves okay that may even be significant some someone wants some something reversed perhaps someone wishes that they could turn back the hands of time or uh, they want some situation reversed perhaps um, someone wants you to come back home uh, I'm seeing this is someone that you may possibly consider family. The sun card. This is the truth. Okay, this is actually the queen of swords. Someone may be in the queen of swords energy. This right here is, is, is an energy of positivity. So... Your spirit guides want you to know that regarding this situation, someone still feels like posit a positive connection and someone still feels optimistic about having this future with you. It's like it, it's almost like nothing's changed for this person. Like nothing has changed. Uh, someone still sees or a or they're beginning to see if they hadn't seen before mm. anything else you want us to know 
foresight. That's an energy of moving forward. Mm. Okay, so Quail, Guardian of Amakua is showing up 24. So let's see here. Okay, so, so it says here, no matter how compelling an experience of challenge, darkness, or defeat may seem, you have divine protection and the promise of safe passage through the dawn. You will see and hear the truth of the light. You shall not be alone in the, on this journey. So guys, and I'll help you find your true north. Hmm. Information that may have been hidden for a time will come to light. A guiding intelligence is assisting you safely through a situation that is otherwise confusing or dangerous. Divine powers are helping you in matters to do with battles, unfairness, or injustice. Whether you're consciously aware of these things or not, trust in the signs you see and especially in the truth that you hear, sometimes beneath what is being spoken. The accuracy of your insights and perceptions are heightened at this time. Hmm. So it's also saying in Hawaiian, Amokua refers to venerable ancestors. This oracle indicates that loved ones on the other side are receiving your prayers and intentions for their healing and sending you love and assistance. So uh, you may have been praying that something uh, gets restored there's something that is getting restored okay something's getting restored it's like a, a major change a major shift happening here 22 22 yeah something may something having to do with a relationship a connection of some sort okay that is the message. If this message resonates, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Until next time, love, peace, divine light.